Well, hello, 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 Maramai, and welcome back to the basement. Uh, we have had a minor save corruption issue, um, but fortunately, I did a backup, so we're okay. But uh, it might mean I don't get any trophies for this run, but I will just have to learn to love again. <coughs> Excuse me, I have a cold, but I thought I'd plough bravely on in any case and see what's going on. Uh, we had in our furnace a lovely load of irons cooking up. Uh, we've got some iron to drop in there, so let's do that. I can see some glass bottles, which I should not have had because I collected those on a research trip. So, at the risk of... There we go, we'll pop those down there and they will shortly disappear. Uh, our basic plan for this game session is to relocate... Uh, we found our lovely village just away over there. Time to upgrade from our hidey hole and do some renovations. So, whilst our gold is now cooked, we'll grab it. How lovely. Lots of gold, lots of iron. Got lots of lovely stuff in there as well. Uh, there's our diamonds, of course. Uh, so, the plan is to take as much as we can carry, which we're going to. Uh, they seem to have plenty of beds over there anyway, but... Uh, Hey, uh, it seems as well, looking at our health bar, we did all that digging and a little bit of fighty fighting going on as well. Uh, let's get some eating done. I think I'll get some apples down. Uh, that should do us for now, because over the hill we have all sorts of bountiful things. So we don't need... I was going to set up a farm today, but I don't really need to do that. It's all over there. And already the tech tops us up all the way. Not quite, but it's less for us to carry, so that is okay. We can't eat gold. We'll have a little bit of that lamb that I've just thrown on the floor for no reason. Let's get that in us. Okay, let's take everything we can carry that is vaguely important. I've got dirt all over the place. Uh, we'll take our first pickaxe, a couple of doors because you never know, stone, spider eyes, take some sugar, bit of string, uh, bones could be good, better not leave the old diamonds behind, because that would be foolish, even by my standards. Uh, let's take the furnace, uh, I think there may be a crafting table or two over there, but we will take this anyway. And how many inventory slots do we have left? One, two, oh, we've got two slots left. Well, we'll leave the dirt because it's all over the place. We'll take the relatively interesting stone. And with that, let us bid goodbye to our hidey hole. And let's get going to a new base. Now, I do remember from when we were looking around the place that there were... Can I get out that way? I can, but it's a little bit around the houses. Uh, we saw a couple of zombie villages... Uh, going around the place, so we're going to need to be a little bit careful whilst we do our restorations. Uh, maybe just try and keep them in the houses that they uh, zombied in, shall we say. There we go. I'm pretty sure it was... There it is, just in the distance. Oh, some uh, sea pickles down there. Could be useful at some point. A little bit of a coral bay, all very nice, but... Uh, just very pretty, I'm afraid. No use to the coral yet, I don't think. But here we are, over in our new home base. Uh, I quite like this large house just up the hill there. There's a nice double-fronted house and all that stuff. So I think we'll adopt that one. Unless, of course, there's a zombie in it telling us that uh, it's his, in which case we'll just... Uh, We'll let him stay there. No point in fighting the guys for their own houses. That's just rude. So here we are on the inlet. They built us a little dock, so let's use it. Jump out. You don't want to do that, Mr. Dolphin. Right. <laughs> okay, and away we go, up the hill, into our village. So we may as well go along. No, let's not go along the path. I will sort that out later sure there's nobody wandering around that could upset us, or more accurately, that we could upset. No one in here. I will get everything fixed up as we go as a sort of thank you for letting me move in type way. Uh, 
but here we are. I may redo some of that with some newer stone as time goes on, but for now, we have a home. I think the first thing we should think about doing is getting rid of those cobwebs. Yes, it is. So let's get those sheared out of the way. Thank you. And thank you. I'm not sure what they will come up as. Possibly string, possibly cobweb. They come out of cobwebs. Oh, well. That will do then. So we've got a couple of renovations to be doing in here. In that case, in that case, I don't really want cobwebs around all the windows. So let's do some spring cleaning. That does not work. Ah, you can chop them up with a sword. Looks like they're going into string, so that seems quite nice. First thing I may think about doing is putting some windows in. But for now, there we go. So there's a bit of spring cleaning. We're going to need a door. I am happy we brought doors. There we go. So let's put a door there and claim the house. Fantastic. Hello, new house. There we go. I see we've got a bit of work to do in terms of logs and all the good stuff. But uh, we can deal with that. Plenty of string going around the place. So, there we go. A new home. Uh, growing outside here, we have carrots, of course. What do you think about all these logs? I'm going to clear up. This is a composter, which we will learn to use. Uh, these appear to be beetroot, so that's very nice as well. We've got a farm all set up. I seem to remember we had some cows over there, so it's all looking quite a nice place to hang out. We've got a sheepy over there too. All right, uh, was there anything interesting hanging out in our chest? There was not, so let's put all the interesting stuff in it, because it's not cool losing interesting stuff. Uh, if we've got any food around the place, we'll keep that down the bottom. Uh, yeah, we'll leave our table there. We don't need two beds necessarily, but uh, I know what we could do. There we go. Let's make a... Oh, you need to be wood, don't you? Right. Okay, renovations. Here we go. Let's For now, let's just dig you out of there. And then you out of there, because you're not really what we needed. And they are oak planks, of which we have quite a few. So that will be very nice indeed, just to uh, shore the place up. In which case, we'll fill in all the holes. Thusly. There we go. And I don't think we need all that stone inside either. One, two, three. One, two, three. May as well get those bits of stone. And I think... Do we have some... Planks missing outside. We did have some cobblestone missing outside, so let's grab some string. I'm sure that'll be useful for fishing and bows and all sorts of wonderful things. There we go. And we'll put some nice clean stone down there. I'll clean all the... Uh, I'll clean all that stone goes up as time goes on. Um, I've got plenty to spare, but for now... I think it's probably more important to think about uh, just redoing the redoing the house and uh, making sure we don't get crept up on. There we go. Build some of those to jump up to the roof to make sure that's all in one piece. No, it is not. Well, if it's just that one, hello sheep. Are you good, mate? Good times. Uh, just the one lot of cobwebs on the roof, so that is okay. Quite a bit of stuff to think about fixing up around there. We need to fix up all those wooden beams, but uh, there we go. A lovely new house. Better put some lights up, though, otherwise it ain't going to be that homely. Oh, I was going to put the. I was going to make that a nice double bed. Give us room to uh, room to spread out. And our survey said... Oh, how lovely. Uh, good -o. That can right. Okay. Oh, well, there we go. That is a pretty good start. What I would like to do is get some glass cooking up. Uh, 
to sort those windows out. So let's see if we can convert one of these houses into some sort of kitchen. Oh yes, there might be all sorts of wonderful things around. I'm waiting there. Potatoes in there, be ready. See, it's coming up to night time as well, so... Uh, oh yes, we had a brewing stand in the church, didn't we? In which case... Let's uh, take a moment. Let's just say thank you to the church. Let's, have you up. Let's keep it in character for now. Oh yes, doesn't that all look lovely? Uh, so we've got a brewing stand there, and I think up here... Actually, just on the other side of the brewing stand is what we will make our cooking area. Because it's accessible from the door. We've got plenty of wheat going on there as well. So we are all very, very nicely set. I'm pretty sure I saw some zombie guys down here. Oh, well, we've got some sheepies there anyway. Hopefully this... Lead down to a little beach, get some sand to cook up. Yes! But I don't seem to think we have a spade. So we're going to have to do it the hard way. But hey. Home renovations never eat. Well, that could have gone wrong, couldn't it? Turns out there was a big hole under there. And that's why you don't dig straight down for sand. As soon as you disturb it, any gaps below it all just drop away. Although, this could be quite an interesting, uh... Ah, oh, it could have been quite an interesting, uh, but it, uh, turned out not to be. But, anyway, that is certainly plenty sand for us to, uh... Climb out using the water. That is plenty of sand for us to cook up for some windows, so let's go do that. We can't be far off, uh, game day bedtime, I'm sure, but... Not entirely convinced. I explored this whole village before. I remember there were guys around it who mysteriously seem to be not here now, which is a shame. We could have helped them out a bit. Right. Well, there we go then. So we were cooking up our stuff in the church, weren't we? Probably a good time to do some. Harvesting, but if I do all that in the morning, right, let's get the coal in there and the sand in there. You can go along and do what you're doing. Ah, so there we go. A lovely new home, especially for us to wander around in. Uh, it will be quite helpful to have a well stocked base like this. We've got a couple of animals going around, uh, going around uh, which is very nice too place to eat over there, place to keep stuff, which is always very helpful indeed. Let's keep tools and stuff over there. Oh, I can fix up the bow with that string, that's what I can do. Did I bring our crafting table? I'm pretty sure I did. There it is, look. Now, can I fix it with the string? Probably not. Easier just to make another one, really. So, let's do that. We need some sticks. Did I make some sticks? I get confused. Ah, I need more planks than I've got. Oh well. Although, there's plenty of planks around the place. Somebody cut all the trees down and didn't replant them. Not cool, my friends. Not cool. Now that is a nice little house. You must have some planks, haven't you? Yes. We'll borrow you. He didn't give all my axes away. I did not. There we go. Couple of blanks. Good o. Right. So we need sticks. Got sticks. And now we need string, which we've got. A bow. Have I got enough for a fishing rod? I do not. Well, we can fish later. I need another three sticks. Plenty of string, but uh, no matter. Right. So, let's get everything gently unloaded, and then at least we've got empty pockets to be going on with. Uh, 
stick our lovely iron tools along the middle. Everything else can go down there. Everything else can go. Not you. <laughs> Everything else can go up there. And we can be organised just in time, I think. Where is the sun? Arise first. It must be sink sinking behind those mountains. We'll get a clock done and uh, pop it around the place somewhere. Now, how do you make a clock? I'm pretty sure I've got everything I need. I've got plenty of iron, plenty of gold. Must be a clock in here somewhere. Equipment? Nope. Items? Nope. Nature. Ain't gonna be nature. Let's try a different... Oh, did I leave that as craftable? Doo -doo -doo. Come on, clocky, clocky, clock. Well, let's just uh, let's just give in messing about and see if we can search for it. Color. Oh, there it is. Look, what do I need for a clock? Four iron and one redstone. What well, we um, we haven't quite got that, have we? Three iron. How upsetting. We're just going to have to guess what time it is, and if it is sleep time, it will let us sleep. Uh, but it won't. So there we go. Right. Let's get our pockets emptied, and then. Sometime around there, in any case, it should be time for bed. But there we go. Mission accomplished for today, game day. And as soon as it lets me sleep, we'll get up, we'll do some farming. Because who doesn't like farming? And uh, explore around. I see, you've got lots of lovely trees. We could go and plant those today, couldn't we? Doesn't look like I brought my hoe. No jokes, please. It's a family show. So let's, um, or did I? If I put it away in here, we'll grab it and plant some trees. I don't think it has a massive impact in terms of, uh, no, I did not, which means I need more sticks, I think. Uh, it doesn't have a massive impact um, doing a hoe on a, <laughs> can't say it with a straight face, um, planting saplings in, a, in hewn ground, but... Uh, well, if you've got it, why why not use it? So in that case, I'm going to have to use another tree to get some sticks to make a hoe. But anyway, renewable resources and all of that stuff. Hup. There we go. I'm pretty sure by the time we've done this, let's get rid of those branches. Always plenty of wood. Don't be crouching around here. Right. There looks to be some uh, mines underneath the village as well, so they can be interesting uh, to explore, but uh, that is certainly not for today. Okay, let's give us some planks, and then let's give us some... I'm going to put that on the other side. It was confusing. Then we're going to get some sticks. Then we're going to make... Then we're going to get some stone. I usually carry that all that in my pocket, just because then when you're trying to craft stuff, you don't go, uh. Ho! Then we'll pop outside. Ooh, spare chicken egg. Hello, chicken. Right. And then we'll get those planted, and then I'm pretty sure it will be time for bed. Whether the gaming gods go with me or not on that score. There we go, one there. Let's put another one over there. Because I have three. Another one there. I'm going to need lots of wood t as time goes on to rebuild all of this uh, Hello. Uh, to rebuild all of this village. That must be nearly sleep time. What is going on? Let's see if it'll let me. Is it going to let me? I can only sleep at night, but at least I have reset my spawn point. In that case, it looks like today game day is going to be this entire episode. Um, so, in that case, let's do the farming I was planning on doing in any case. Loads of lovely carrots. Which means I can uh, get the piggies out. Get those replanted. 
Uh, I'm going to leave the beetroot for now, because I'm not entirely sure what I'm supposed to do with it. I'm sure there is a good reason for having beetroot, but... Uh, or in all honesty, I'm stuffed if I know what it is. Uh, and we'll go and get some 47 carrots. That is quite some breakfast we've got lined up there. But we'll certainly do the wheat. Oh, I've already got some seeds to replant, which is very nice. Oh, missed. <laughs> there we go. Get it all replanted. And at some point, we may get... Uh, we may manage to get some villagers back around the place. Uh, plenty of wheat, which means plenty of bread, which means we can have some toast in the morning. Uh, I seem to... Hello? Hello, yes. Right, let's take you. <laughs> Lovely. So, there we go. As I finish up collecting all those crops, I think it's probably time to start signing off. So, thank you, uh, as ever, for watching. Uh, welcome to our abandoned village, or a zombie village, or whatever you wish to call it. Uh, we've got a little bit of reparation still to do around here, but uh, let's not get stuck in these things. Oh, uh, dear. Can we cut our way out? Yes, we can. Ah, thank you. Um, yes, some reparations to do to make it all perfectly normal and nice again, but it's a nice, easy, sensible base for us to have. Uh, no interesting things around here in the lower village. <laughs> You've just got a garden. I mean, that's very nice and all, but hey ho. Some cows over there. Lovely. Yes. Yeah. So, thank you indeed very much for watching, as always. And we'll be back uh, next time. I was going to say when, but I have no idea when that's going to be. So, <laughs> I will see you in the game day morning. Bye-bye uh, for now. Bye.